this is Stampy, and welcome back to my Let's Play on Minecraft Story Mode. It's freaky, right? This place is dead. I'll be quiet and let them talk. Strange. Though I imagine you might be relieved to have a little quiet right now, huh? Okay. I was almost expecting, nope. <laughs> I don't know, another huge... Shall I tell him to shush so I can speak? No, I'll let him talk. Yeah, the admin definitely seems to like those. But nothing. Don't be fooled, guys. If it's this quiet on our way to depower the admin, then it's gotta be a trap. Well, I'm not seeing anything trappish yet, but I'll keep an eye out. Whoa. What's all of that stuff? It's almost like we're inside a giant computer or something. And someone is watching us. Friend or foe, though? That's the big question. I don't think it's the admin. He's too focused on himself. Oh, is that Lucas? Is that Lucas? Is that Nelly? Well, would you look who it is? This is where everyone gets trapped. Oh, it's me! That's me! The parrot prince! <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> look at me of all my parrots! That is amazing! The most dramatic entrance ever! Going on. Stand down, ocelots. Lucas! Looks like the tables have finally turned, huh, Jesse? We can't let you keep doing what you're doing. That's enough now. Whoa, sorry. Guys, Lucas, I think you're confused. It's me! Oh, we're not confused. We know exactly who you are. Now, hang on, everyone. No. It's our turn to talk. Not yours. Not anymore. I reformed the Ocelots because I wanted to remind everyone of how things were before. And most of all, I wanted to remind you. No, Because but... the Jesse I know wouldn't be running around on some power trip locking people up. Lucas. So yeah, I set your prisoners free. What are you going to do about it? Yeah, and telling us our builds were ugly. It wasn't me that locked you all up. It was the admin. Wait, what? No, you said you defeated the admin. Everything you think I've told you since I came back from the Ice Palace was a lie. The admin locked me in a prison underground, took my identity, came back here, and pretended to be me. That is... No. How do we know this isn't a trick? No trick, friend. And it's not the first time. My friend Voss, the admin did the same thing with him. Yeah. We saw the whole thing. Is this really true? All those horrible things you did that... Oh, give him a hug. Look at me just standing there with my parrots. God, my arms must be aching by now. <laughs> just standing there with loads of parrots. Sort it out. What in the world are we going to do next? Wait, why are you even in here? We're trying to get to something called the terminal. We have a word of passage. <coughs> Potato. That we can apparently use to take away the admin's powers for good. Yeah, a lot of that was way over my head, especially the potato, but I'm in. You just lead the way, and the new ocelots will have your back. Well, it looks like we have a, ourselves a mini little army here. Well, would you look at this. And some outfits. It's quite the Jesse memorabilia collector. I know we don't have much time, but it might be smart to suit up properly. Agreed. I just love the way I'm still standing with, with all of those parrots. Right, this is the, the outfit that I wore through uh, most of my time. So, just in case you don't know what's going on with the parrots and why I have a bunch of parrots, so I did a series with Stacy Plays called My Story Mode House, where we basically built our houses from Minecraft Story Mode. And that was kind of my first time I really played with parrots and had a bunch of parrots and I got loads of them and I became the parrot prince and we had a parrot party and I just love walking around with loads of parrots on me. And yeah, because of that, they decided to, to add me in the game. So a series that we did based on this game then influenced this game. It's kind of just like an endless circle, but really, really cool. But anyway, sorry, chattering too much. I know you want to get on with the action. Let's suit my armor on and let's go and see if we can find this terminal. Now you look like you're ready for a showdown. Agreed. Oh, thanks, guys. 
Time to end this. Ocelots! Oh! Right then, let's work together and see if we can track down where this terminal is. So I guess, I guess potato, is that just like a password or something okay, that we I say? Terminal, what would I look like? Why, hello there. Wasn't expecting you. Uh-oh. Oh, this isn't good. What's the move here, Jesse? Talk to him. I'll distract him. You guys find the terminal. But this is my... Yeah, talk to him. That's, that's why I wanted my plan to be anyway before I even saw the option. So definitely the choice I want to go for. It's over, admin. We're here to... Excuse me. Excuse me. We? Ah! What? Did he lock them all away? They go! Oh, I am so upset that you're back. That wannabe ninja, Ivor, told me you were dead. Hearing that made me feel- Where is Ivor? Do you reckon he's hiding somewhere? He could be. He is a ninja. Dead. And that's your fault. Yes, it was just a temporary case of death. Oh, you smug, arrogant, insignificant. What, pray tell, are you hoping to accomplish by challenging me? I don't know if you've noticed, but I'm just a touch more powerful than you. I know. That's why I'm not here to fight you. I want to talk this over. Jesse, a uh, Jesse. Ugh, talking it out. What's the point in that? That's what losers do. Real people, awesome people, settle their differences with, with. No, you're not doing any talking right now. Right now, you're just gonna shut up and listen. Nah, -uh, you don't tell me what to do. That's not how this works. So far, so good with reasoning. And you know what? It's just as well you're back. Because being Jesse is the worst! Oh yes, yes, I said it! I hate being you! Your, your people, your friends, they're so needy, so clingy! I have to listen to their stupid voices day after day after day, just asking for things. I, mean, I, I thought being Jesse meant that people would do what I wanted to do. No one ever asks what I want! Ah, it's all, can I have iron and can I have gold? Well, I'm back now. I, I, I could help you take back over. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I suppose you could. Yeah. It's just, but it was fun at first. I show them some super amazing display of my awesome powers. They'd laugh. I'd laugh. But soon they were just asking me to do that all the time. <laughs> you, know, you know what's funny? You've made me see something. I mean, it's starting to feel like maybe I should just leave being Jesse to you. There's a twist. This is too good to be true. <laughs> this is too good to be true. Yeah, this sounds like a trick. Best idea you've ever had. Let me just say nothing. Let me just see what, what he says. I don't trust him. Of course I don't trust him. Look at him. Of course I don't trust him. Well, this has all been terribly enlightening. And I, I think He's going to try and push me off. Is he going to try and push me off? Don't push me off. I don't want to be pushed off. Don't you push me off now. Next time. Yeah. The next world I build after I bedrock over yours. Oh, I'm going to get it totally right with that one. I knew it. I knew there was a twist. A whole new set of people. A whole new world. Oh, I'll be a great leader, a great friend next time around. I should thank you for all these, these wonderful little lessons you've helped me to learn. Romeo, please give this world another chance. One more chance. Could, would love to, but won't, shan't. This way is easier for me. Oh well, toodles. Well, that went, I mean, <laughs> at least he didn't kill us oh, yet. He's just going to destroy the world now. You guys are okay. Yeah. He just blipped us back to the hallways again. Such a... Ooh, such a jerk. Okay, well, he's going to be trying to bedrock over the entire world. Oh, he is? He's already done it. He doesn't wait around, does he? He doesn't have lunch first and then bedrock over the entire world. He goes straight to do it. Number one on the to-do list. So the world isn't really going to survive when it's bedrocked over. 
It's gonna be basically, you know, like where like the the Fredstown people lived. The world's gonna basically become like that. And that wasn't a good place to live, if you can remember. So we have to get to that terminal, and we have to get it quick. This? How are we gonna stop this? We need to take his powers away. Find the terminal space. Exactly. I just said that, Jesse. The roof. That's where the admin keeps his portal to the terminal thing. Go. Come on. We need to get to that portal before the bedrock closes up. All right, time to get a move on. The thing is, we don't even know what this terminal is. Like, is it gonna be just like a computer? But like, computers aren't really in Minecraft, but I gotta go fast because we're about to be over. Oh, we're above. We're above the bedrock. Oh, no, no, but Lucas isn't. Look, he's got time, just run. He could have made that. He could have made, maybe he could have made that. Oh, they're doing like another layer of bedrock over this one. We're like kind of trapped in between two layers of bedrock. Not a good place to be. So is, is is this his portal to the new world that he's creating then? Maybe the terminal's gonna be through here then. Maybe there's like one special like magic world that like links all of the others together. We made it. We're here. Where? Where's here? Yeah, but we don't know where here is. Exactly. I agree with you. Everyone agrees with me today. <laughs> it is funny when you like say what they say like a second before they say it. Is this like the void? Are we in space? There's a tree. A clock from the admin's tower? Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, uh, I uh, found the Colossus. Yeah, I remember that guy. Could do about him. The trip down memory lane is nice and all, but how do we find the primary terminal thingy? Uh, so much stuff use word of passage. Yeah. Think, think like the admin. Makes sense of it all. Uh -huh. Well, it's the admin's place, right? So what would he do? He'd probably know where he was going, so... Admin protocol initiated. It's him! Oh, it's just more of his stupid recordings. You've selected admin protocol. Oh, it's like an automatic assistant or something. Basically the admin's version of Siri. Welcome to Terminal Space. Ooh. That's like a theme park ride. Well, shall we? I wish you could have um different color redstone lamps. I know red redstone lamps make sense. It'd be cool if you could change the color of them. I mean, these are more like sea lanterns, aren't they? Anyway, sorry. I'll be quiet so you can hear Petra. The automated personal assistant system was developed to aid the mighty admin in menial tasks and help his friends navigate the terminal space. Man, so when he first made all this, he was still hoping his friends would come here too. Kinda makes me feel bad for him, actually. Nobody ever said it was easy to hang on to your friends. Yeah, I'm kind of a bit beyond feeling bad for him. I don't care how tragic of a backstory he has. Like, he destroyed everything. <laughs> it's gonna take a lot for me to start to feel sorry for him. There are ways to deal with things, and he's not been dealing with them very well, is a soft way to put it, I think. That's gotta be it. Is that the terminal? It just looks like a puzzle from an adventure map, doesn't it? <laughs> like a really old classic adventure map. Please enter your password to begin a new program. Potato! Potato! The, that was all over my head. Potato! Password. That must be the word of passage. Potato 451. Four, okay, so I guess that... Is there going to be a potato inside of this chest? And then put the potato in the item frame, and then type in somehow 451. Material request. I mean, it must be talking about the potato, right? Potato! Sounds right to me. Give me a potato! Uh, potato? Potato! Please? Acquiring... Potato! Yay! Thank you! Now cake! Give me cake! I request cake! Not for the puzzle, just for me! Wait, two potatoes? One potato, two potatoes. Yeah, a normal one and a poisoned one. 
Which one do we use? Well, the protocol isn't hashtag poison potato. It's just hashtag potato. That weird hashtag thingy. That might mean something. Oh, I don't think that symbol ever actually means anything. Hmm. Gotta figure out which one is correct. I mean, if we type in 451, we can just put both potatoes in after that. I mean, my instinct is just normal potato, I guess. I hope this is right. But, like, if not, we'll try the poison Still one. need to enter the rest of the word of passage. Won't know if this is right or not till I do. Right, so then... 451. Let's go and use the, the grid. So... Oh, okay, I see what we're doing. So... Oh, place item. Oh, oh, remove block. What item could I place? Okay, no, I just removed it. So four, five, and then one? No? Is it not working? Do you think it's supposed to be the poison potato? Or is it just going to not work until I back out? That's exactly right. Do you reckon, I, reckon, I reckon it's the poison potato then. Right, uh, let's place the poison potato and see if this is going to work. Let's try this one. Does hashtag mean poison then? Maybe that's like... Need to enter the rest of the word of passage. Oh, I thought I did. I don't know if this is right or not till I do. Um, right, let's go and use this again. So I thought it would be like four, five, one. Like going from like left to right. That's four, five. It was four, five, one, wasn't it? Hmm. Don't think that's exactly right. I was thinking this was going to be really easy. Let's go and speak to, to one of these guys. Can I have a clue? I can't, they're not even going to give me a clue. I can't even go anywhere. See, the thing is, I don't know whether I got the potato part right. Unless there is, like, a different item I need to put in, but it's got to be that. And then, well, it wasn't potato 541, was it? Hmm. Four, and, oh, do you think maybe, maybe I'm typing it in wrong. Maybe it's supposed to be, like, okay, maybe it's supposed to be, like, a bar graph? So it's, like, Four. Ah, oh, there we go. Little lights went on. Okay, so all I need to do is like type it in like that. Okay, I got it right. I was just typing it wrong, but it still didn't open. It still doesn't open, so I reckon it has to be the actual potato. Okay, okay, that sounds like progress, right? Yep, the wrong potato. So right, to be fair, I put the right potato in first. Oh no, is it working? Was that a good thud? Oh, maybe that was right. Maybe it just didn't do it until I backed out then. Oh, hello. It's Fred. Fred. Zara. Hi. If you're seeing this recording, well, I guess the worst has happened. And you just put the word of passage into the primary terminal. I wish the terminal could just take away Romeo's admin powers. It'd be easier that way. But making this gauntlet was the best I could do. Put your hand into the pedestal to receive the gauntlet. It's got the power to make Romeo normal again. It might take a few hits to remove his powers entirely, but it'll get the job done. Do you understand? Yes. Yes, I do. Seems pretty simple. Not another gauntlet, though. Gauntlets have brought us nothing but trouble so far. Sorry, Zara is not here right now, but we can do it. Oh no! We we weren't gonna be able to do it until the admin showed up. What's happening? We're here to stop you, Romeo, once and for all. I told you, your world's done. No take that. And here come the Colossus again. Colossus? Colossi? Colossi? I think it's supposed to be. Right, she need to get the gauntlet. Is it gonna fit? Put it in, put it in, put it on! Put your hand in! Ah, a square. Just the right size for my hand. What? Gauntlet delivered. Okay, that's a pretty cool looking gauntlet. Well, this should come in handy. What have you done? Right then, so it looks like we should have everything that we uh, we need to be able to do with the, the admin. Let's see what happens if I hit him. Hit him, hit him. So it said it might take a few hits, so it might not be down in one, but oh, that seemed effective. That seemed to be doing the trick. I don't know what you're playing at, but it ends now. He's kind of got like a bit like glitchy when I hit him, didn't he? Then it ends now. We've taken away some of his powers, look. So he can still fly and stuff, but. Come on. 
Oh, you, you think you're very clever, aren't you? You're still like a little bit super powery, but <laughs> not completely. Okay. And that is a another power that he has. Hey, Jesse. Remember when we first met? And dress up like Voss as well. That was back when I thought we could still be friends. Huh. Right, one more hit. Is that going to take away his powers? Oh, no. He's learned not to get close to me when I have the Gordon in now. Challenge was my first gift to you. Now, it's going to be where I bury you. Okay, and it now looks like he is basically the, the Colossus. And I need to get out of here as fast as I can. <laughs> run, run back the other way. Run back the other way. <laughs> we keep doing this all day. We're going to run out of platforms. <laughs> No, punch his punch, punch, no! I need to punch his fist. If I, I need to like punch up as he does that. But did that count as a hit? I can still use the gauntlet. Of course I can. Die already. But punch, punch up, punch his fist, punch his fist, fist bump. <laughs> oh, okay, well, I gotta go, I gotta go. Oh, wasn't ready, wasn't prepared for that. <laughs> they need to give me some warning before they're gonna make me do something like that. I'm all here sitting back enjoying watching the action and suddenly it's like quick tape and I'm like, okay, okay. Get he still has his power though, so we're taking it away a bit, but oh no, oh look, he can't grow anymore. Oh, why do I feel so powerless? He still has power to have goofy, scary eyes though, and that's in some way the worst power of all. <laughs> Trick down memory lane as much as I have. So now this is looking back to, to episode two in the, the Ice Palace where he was a snowman for a while. I almost forgot about that. How could I forget about Snowman Admin? <laughs> oh dear. Right then, so I'm going to be really mean here and I'm going to end the episode here because I think that we still have a uh, a little bit left to, to go. There's probably going to be some more after the, the boss uh, fight and I don't want this video to go on for too long because, uh, yep, I need to rest my voice for a little bit and otherwise uh, anyone's going to fall asleep. But don't worry, I won't leave you hanging. I'll upload the, the next episode uh, as soon as I can and we can carry on uh, to see where probably this adventure is going to, to end. So link down in the description to the next episode once i've uploaded it but now thanks so much for watching and i will see you all in the next one bye